Take a look at it. This is the original OEM air intake box that the Saab 95 had. We don't want that anymore. Here's what we need. Just take it in. Spectra AEM. I've always loved AEM. I don't like oil and filters. Oh yeah. Ten extra horses at least. Let's check out what we got. All this... I should mention, by the way, 40 bucks for all this stuff on Amazon. Prime shipped, of course. I remember when just to even make a RAM intake, it used to cost like 110 112 Because pretty much you had to buy them pre-made. You could always go buy a Spectra filter and slap it on instead of your intake box. Oh, high school days. Slapping them on 90, 91 Honda Accords. Yeah. Actually, we did that with a couple of my friends. Anyway, I'm done reminiscing. Here's what we got. Not a Spectra. This is a Speed by Spectra. The 400 mile per hour company. Oh, that's bullshit, I guarantee it. 94, 19, 3 inch aluminum tube, 6 inches long. Yeah. Oh, fierce! Oh. They give you a little, like, gym bag it's in. Speed by Spectra. Whoa, shiny. What's this? Actually says Spectra. Shouldn't it say Speed by Spectra? I see you. Now I got fingerprints all over it. I'll have to clean it up. Good enough. Now on to the AEM filter. There's something that sticks out. We're back, baby. We're making it great again. I guess. What's this? Precision tuned intakes. Brute force air filters. Performance strut bars. Yada, yada, yada. They have an Instagram page. Twenty-eight bucks on Amazon, just for this size. All the rest were forty or above. Now, before we get into that. Look, a sticker. I can literally make it a legit AEM intake. Though it's black outlined. It's supposed to be red outlined. Didn't want to pay the extra couple cents for the colored ink. Ain't that like life. Says it right there, too. You can show it off at the car show. Oh, shit. 
shit. Well, I'm going to put the camera down, put it all together. We'll see what we got at the end. Oh, yeah. Take it in. Really, take it in. That's the pipe that goes to the mass airflow sensor. In case you were wondering, where did that part come from? To me, looks legit. How oh, 40 bucks. Get some griffins out of it. Clear. Have extra room to work down here because there's always going to be something to do. Next step is to get it actually hooked up in the car. And then try it out. Got it up and in. Now just gotta kind of position it a little bit. Get our reclaim our mass airflow sensor. Put it in there. Connect the other hose. Fasten it all up. Bada bing, bada boom. As you can see, there is a lot more room. I can even, if I ever need to work on the intercooler hoses or all these, because I know when you especially look at that, the damn well soon those are gonna need changed got plenty of room. I can work on all that. Don't have to take it. Look at him. It just rests perfectly in there. Bloop. Hopefully it does what I asked. Give me an extra horse or two at the most. How that'd be great. And it cleared up so much room. And I ain't gonna lose no damn pipes. No more snake pipe to lose your wrenches.